morning everyone welcome back to vlogmas it is december 14th i think and i'm up i'm sure you can guess where i'm going to pilates i want to show you guys my outfit today this is my fun pilates outfit i normally don't wear like little like leg warmers and a skirt and the whole thing but i thought it would be fun this morning so i think i ordered this skirt off amazon they have it in other colors i ordered it in pink too and then this little what are these called a shrug i ordered this from this brand called blotch i think and it's like a ballet brand but it's really comfortable and then this bra i think is from gymshark and then i got these little leg warmers the other day at brandy melville which i showed you guys and then i've got my uggs on so this is my pilates outfit this morning i haven't gone to pilates in like five or six days no it's been almost i haven't been to pilates in exactly a week so i'm really excited to go back and get fit and get sore it's gonna feel really great also if you guys are new here and you guys have not yet please subscribe you guys can hit the red button down below also follow me on instagram and tiktok because you guys see all the stuff that i'm doing over there links to clothes i always have different things over on my social media so follow me over there but i am gonna get going exhale press chest exhale press your ribs down bicep curls up and down and then exhale press your chest down exhale press your ribs down bicep curls up and down and then exhale press your chest down bicep curls up and down i'm back from pilates i've got my coffee here i just made a quick little peppermint ice latte and i am about to make a little bit of breakfast and i'm about to take rituals new daily symbiotic plus supplement i really like this you guys know i've talked about it before and if you guys haven't heard about ritual i'll share a little bit about what i take why i take it and i also have a discount code for you guys so if you guys want to check out ritual you guys can use my code it's keaton20 so you'll get 20 percent off your first month when you use my code so you guys can go to ritual.com slash keaton20 and that will get you 20 percent off your first month but if you guys don't know what symbiotic plus is i'll tell you a little bit about it so i've always taken like a prebiotic or a probiotic but what's really cool is that this is a daily three in one so this not only has a prebiotic a probiotic it also has a postbiotic which a lot of brands don't have probiotics for example help like relieve gas and bloating and then prebiotics support gut health like they help support the growth of beneficial bacteria within your gut and then a postbiotic fuels the cells that really help support your gut barrier function which i think is really amazing also what's really cool about this is that it has a delayed release capsule which is especially important for your gut health because that means it will release in your colon and not your stomach where it'll thrive the best overall i just really enjoy taking ritual and working with ritual they're very transparent brand they tell you every single thing that's in these and i just really love that they have a subscription that you guys can get delivered to your door monthly so it's really easy that way i don't forget about it because it just comes straight to my house and i just really really enjoy it and i feel like if you guys are interested or you guys have taken a probiotic or prebiotic or something before this is a really big step up because it's got all three in one i think you guys would really benefit from this if you guys are interested i'm gonna take mine with my morning coffee and again i will link ritual in the description down below if you guys want to go and you guys can check them out and use my code again it's keaton20 and i'll get you 20 percent off your first month with ritual also i don't know if i mentioned this but ritual has a really clean formula which means like they're vegan friendly they don't have like gmos or anything like that animal products which is also a really good plus this coffee is hitting the spot so are my vitamins <laughs> i am gonna open up some mail that i got i ordered two of these items but then i got a surprise little package from boys live which is like one of my favorite brands but i'll show you guys what i ordered first i wore this skirt to the harry styles concert and i'm obsessed with it originally when i ordered the skirt for harry styles i wanted the silver one but it wasn't in stock and so i just ordered the green but the silver skirt just came back in stock so i ordered it it's danielle guzio It's so freaking cute. Oh my gosh. This is like the perfect little holiday mini skirt. I am obsessed with it. Now I have it in green and I have it in silver. It's just like the perfect cutest fit ever. I don't know why. I just like absolutely love this skirt. It looks like a top. It's that tiny, but it's so cute. So this is the first thing that I ordered. Next up, I have an Amazon package, but I don't remember what I ordered from Amazon. Oh! 
know. I thought this was gonna be more interesting, but it's not. <laughs> I ordered some things for my trip to Paris so I do want to pack a couple coats as I showed you guys in the last vlog and so I ordered these they're vacuum sealed bags and they come with a little pump so basically you can put like any of your heavier coats you put them in these bags and you suck all the air out and it'll shrink it down and then you can fit a lot more in your bags so I'm gonna probably do that with my coats and then you pack the pump in your luggage that way when you're coming back um, you have room to do that. I'm also going to try and leave room in my luggage so that I can like buy things while I'm in Paris and pack them. But I ordered this off Amazon. It's a really good hack if you guys like struggle with overpacking or if you guys are going on a trip where it's like cold and you want to pack different coats and things like that but you need to have room. Um, this is a good idea to do like the vacuum seal bags. And then I also ordered these packing cubes. I've never packed with packing cubes before but I think I would really enjoy them. These are not as cute as I thought they were gonna be i probably could have found like a cuter brand but they're just like nude like they're plain little nude packing cubes it comes with a bunch of different sizes this is really good if you guys like to plan out your outfits or you guys like to like separate by types of things you can put all your shirts in one all your underwear in one or whatever it is so i got packing cubes and i got vacuum seal bags but now i've got a package from boys lie i have no idea i like wasn't expecting anything from them so it's so cute it's a little teal beanie this is perfect this is what i'm packing on this is what i'm packing on my trip like look how cute this beanie is oh my god this is so cute look how cute this is this is like a thermal and it's actually so cozy i love this little design and then on the back it says perfect match look how cute this is oh my gosh this is so cute and then we've got a little matching this is a hoodie it kind of goes with this beanie but we've got another hoodie. I really like this fabric that they have. Like it's like a thermal kind of fabric or it's like knit, whatever this is. I really love it. It's so cozy. I'm gonna on the back. It's got like some writing. This is super cute. And they also sent matching. I think these are, are these yoga pants? Stop. They're literally yoga pants. These are so fun. Thank you so much, Boys Lie. Also, Louise, my contact at Boys Lie, I love you. Thank you so much. You are so kind to think of me and send me these. It's just the cutest thing ever. I will be packing these on my trip. Hi guys, I am driving to Nick and Natalie's right now because Natalie needed to take some brand photos today. So she was like, can you come over for like 30 minutes and take some pictures um, of me and Nick? Uh, I think it's just for Instagram. I actually don't know what it's for, but I'm over here doing that really quickly. Just wanted to give you an update because that's what I'm doing today. And then I'm gonna stop at the store. I've gotta get some wrapping paper and I need to wrap Brandon and I's uh, Christmas, well, no, I guess not Brandon and I's. My Christmas presents to Brandon. I have to wrap them. So I'm gonna stop at the store and get some wrapping paper after. Who is this? He's very excited for ah! Let me, oh, oh, hi. Is this my favorite man in the whole world? Why are your paws so wet? Why are your paws wet? Hi, Ziggy. Why you got wet paws? Hi, babes. Oh my God. All right, Natalie said she got me something for Christmas, but she's giving we it to me now. We were gonna do gifts. Well, we were gonna do gifts. But then we all flopped. This, and then we all decided to go to Paris instead. So that's our gifts to each other. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm gonna put my, we can it fit in one hand or do yeah, I have to put my yeah, hand down? Hand. Okay, I'm okay. scared. Wait, let me show the vlog first. <laughs> okay, wait, wait, clear your eyes. Okay, I'm looking okay. away. I'm scared. What is this? Oh my God, what is this? <gasps> wait, what is this? You stamp all your books and it says. <gasps> it has my initials yeah, on it. Yeah, it's property the, of the, the, wait, from the library of Keaton. <gasps> wait, this is so cute. Books. Cute. Wait, I've never seen this. I saw it on TikTok. <gasps> How do you feel? I'm feeling ready for your close up, ready for your photo shoot. <laughs> yeah, um, actually, if you cannot get close, I could hear you. <laughs> so, really, like not far a, up. a far up, a full body shot. Yeah, maybe like from the back. But your makeup looks really good. Like, you did it fast and it looks good. Really? I'm back from Target and i am wrapping some presents now for brandon he's literally right on the other side of the door but i went and i picked up all of his stuff from target like the like his stocking stuff and then i have his presents here as well i have to pick up a couple more later this week but i'm gonna wrap them now i'm not the best 
gift wrapper. So we'll see how this goes. These are some of the things I got for his stocking. I'm not gonna say them out loud because he's outside the door. I know he's listening. He loves this. So I got him some of those. I got him, this is like a gift card holder. These. Lots of little things to go in his stocking. We have all of his presents right here. So cute, and now I have to wrap them. I bought this cute wrapping paper from Target. This is the kind of got, actually, I'll show you guys, I guess, when it's wrapped, but I have not wrapped presents in so long, so I really don't know how this is gonna go. Like, I'm not the best wrapper. No, I ruined it. Oh my god, how am I this bad at just cutting paper? Look at this. I ripped it all into pieces. These scissors, I think, are just not sharp enough. Um, I always watch those people on TikTok when they like show you how to wrap really. Oh my god, really random things, and they do it like so well. Like they'll literally wrap the craziest stuff. But it's so satisfying to watch. I wish I had that skill. Wait, you guys. This is so amazing. I'm so proud of myself for being able to wrap this. Good morning, everyone. It is the next day and it is actually like 2 p.m. I woke up this morning and then Brandon and I went to Soho House. Brandon's back. Let me unlock this. We went to Soho House this morning to do some work. So we worked there for a couple hours and now it's like two o'clock. We also had lunch there. And then I forgot that like I can't take photos or videos or anything like that. So I did bring my vlog camera to Soho House and then realized you're not allowed to take photos and videos. So I didn't get to give you guys content, but we're back and I have a couple packages. I figured I would open up with you guys. This is the mail I have, but I think one of them is actually a gift for Nat. So I'm not gonna open it on camera. But I think the rest is PR. Oh, these are my uh, new deodorants I got from Native. I'm really excited. I'm going to be trying some of these out. I've actually tried them before, um, but I haven't had some of these different scents. So thank you, Native. They sent over some deodorant for me. Oh, did they send body wash too? This is perfect because we're literally out of body wash right now. This one's the coconut and vanilla. <gasps> I bet you this one smells so good. Oh my god, yeah. That smells good. We got new body wash, babe. Oh yeah. It smells delish. Next up, this package looks like it is from Buxom. Beauty brands always send over like gift sets around the holidays, so they'll send like, you know, some of like the sets that they're selling and they're really good gifts that I tend to end up giving my friends, like if I already have the product. And this one's really cute. This is a plumping lip set, and then this is a little mascara set. Thank you, Buxom. Oh my gosh, I've never got PR from, how do you say this? Dyers? There's, how do you say this brand? I, I see them all the time, but I've never gotten PR from them. This is for you, babe. You need to use this witch hazel. Cause you're a witch. And you're done. <laughs> cut the cameras. Cut the cameras. James, what was that? Wait, who says cut the cameras? Black China. <laughs> She's in the kitchen or something. She says, cut the cameras. Okay, well, I got some facial toner. This is, there are different witch hazels. One of them is unscented, one of them is rose petal, and one of them is lavender. Whoa. And then I also got, what is this? pH balancing daily cleanser. You know what's so random? I feel like I use all these like bougie skincare things, like facial cleansers, and like I use all this stuff. And I feel like brands like this work the best. So I'm actually gonna try this. It's allergy tested, fragrance free, oil free, sulfate free, non comedogenic. Like it's actually like, like this is serious. You know what I mean? And then what is this? This is a hydrating milky toner. It says snow mushroom. I guess that's like the, um, whatever that's in it. The last thing that I got is um, Nat's present. So I cannot show that on here just in case she watches this vlog. 
but it's really cute. All right, it's very gloomy. Brandon and I have a Levi's event later um, that's on Melrose, and so I'm gonna get ready in a couple hours, but because it's really rainy and gloomy outside, I'm gonna sit and read my book for a little bit. And then um, I'll talk to you guys when I start to get ready. Okay, I have changed and I'm clearly getting ready to do my makeup, which is why I've got my headband on. I'm wearing this sweater, it's so cute. It's from, I'm like, it's so cute. Where is it from? Um, it's from Brandon's Closet actually, but I think it is Adidas Y3. I'll try and find it um, because it's like so cute. So I'm just wearing um, jeans. I'm wearing Levi's because we're going to a Levi's event tonight we're going to a levi's event tonight so that's what's happening i genuinely like if i'm being honest would rather do anything else than go out to an event tonight i tried to tell brandon that like i just think it's better for us to stay in like we hang out and watch white lotus because we watched the first episode of white lotus last night i've never seen any of it so i was like oh let's watch it whatever and now I'm like, why are we going now? I'm like, can we please like stay in? But this is gonna be like our outing of the day. I mean, even though we went and worked at Soho House today, this is gonna be what we do. And I hate doing my makeup at night. Like I hate going the full day, just like fresh face. I don't have any makeup on, I'm like living. And then at like 9 p.m. at night, when you have to go out, you have to do makeup. Like it's so annoying. I sound ungrateful right now, but you guys understand where I'm coming from. Like it's just one of those nights where I'm like, I just don't want to go anywhere. I just like was super into my book and I only have like a hundred pages left and I could totally finish it tonight if I just sat down and grinded it out, but it's a-okay. I am really struggling with a couple Christmas presents that I need to get. And it's stressing me out because I really only have, I think it's like 10 days till Christmas today. So like that's not a lot of time to get the things <laughs> that I need and it's really stressing me out. Normally I'm a little bit more on top of it. Like I'm ordering stuff in like October and I'm being ahead of my game. But this year I'm on the struggle bus. This this foundation really doesn't match my skin. Like, if you guys were wondering, it doesn't. <laughs> and that's just the truth of it. This foundation doesn't match my face, but I don't care. <laughs> I'm wearing a huge sweater. It's fine, it's fine. <laughs> I have been seeing all these TikToks about, like, the placement of your blush and, like, how it helps lift your face and i feel like i definitely put my blush in like i put my blush like all over like on my nose everywhere else and i think i need to like put it up higher on my face that way my that way my contour like looks more snatched also if you guys haven't noticed which most of you guys have because everyone loves to comment about anything i do my hair my face my anything but <laughs> especially my eyebrows I haven't got them done in eight months. That is the truth. I like literally gave up and it's very obvious. Like you guys can clearly tell that I just like stopped caring. I think I'm gonna get them done soon because like I'm tired of like plucking them and like trying to keep them kind of clean. Like they need to be, like I don't think they look great, you know? Like they need to be like waxed a little bit. It's kind of freeing to like not do my eyebrows i just don't care about doing them anymore like i literally haven't even put gel on them or um used an eyebrow pencil like i've done nothing to make them look decent so i don't have a blush brush so i'm actually just gonna use like a little blush stick i used to use this one all the time this is the kindle and kylie one it's actually so cute but I've been seeing, you know, you're supposed to put your blush right here. And normally I put it all right here over my nose, everywhere. But we're going to just like apply the blush. Oh, that was a lot of blush. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. It's all right. We're going to also do the highlighter there, too, to make it look really, you know. I'm going to still do a little bit on my nose because, like, why not? Does this even look any different? Like, normally I put it all over my cheeks. Maybe it does look different. And I just can't tell. Maybe I just, like, don't notice. Hmm. Also, to make this look a little bit more snatched, we're going to take our beauty blender and we're going to just 
just the smallest smallest bit of baking ever and then i'm gonna do my brows <gasps> should i do wings liner maybe i'll do wings liner since i'm wearing like baggy jeans and a sweater i don't know why i feel like that'll make me look more put together <gasps> that was a lot bigger than i thought it was gonna be okay i did not mean to make this wing this big this is too intense for me i cannot believe i used to do my makeup and like i would genuinely take three hours doing my makeup sometimes i go back and like i'll see old like get ready with me videos that i uploaded and like the amount of steps and the seriousness that i like had doing my makeup is so insane like i could not imagine doing half of the stuff in my old makeup videos like i just it would take so long right now I always spray setting powder over my bakage before I wipe it away. I don't know why. Really, honestly, you guys, the best part about having a Dyson is I rarely ever have to fix my hair. Like, I did this three or four days ago. I'm like, I could touch it up if I wanted to, but it's just naturally wavy. Like, this has been the best part about having a Dyson. It's like, I have not even brushed my hair today. It's just like this, and I really like it. All right, I gotta go find my lip liner and put lipstick on, but this is me getting ready to go to the Levi's event and then I'll probably vlog when we get there. You're eating my McFlurry? You better back off. I'm so cold, I don't even know why I'm eating a McFlurry. I know, I'll eat it. <sighs> For you. No, no you can't. Um, we're home from the Levi's event. It was so packed and so loud i got one clip here it is with no sound we're back from the levi's event it was so louded no loud so louded <laughs> i can't speak yeah I, I made brandon get a pair of pants that i'm gonna make him try on for you guys he like is not into this like this style but I just feel like he looks so cute in these pants and I just am trying to get him to branch out a little bit. And I need you guys to hype him up in the comments and tell him how cute he is because these pants are really just adorable and they're Levi's. So when he tries them on, I'll show you what they look like. But I think they're so cute on him. And we stopped at McDonald's and got McFlurries. You look so cute. You look so yes. cute. Babe, you look cute. Hold on, let me turn the light on. I love it. She likes the baggy bag. And I love the shirt with it, with the little, ooh, he's cute. These are his new pants. You guys, come on, wait, hold on. Let me get a, let me get a photo of you. Hi guys, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. For Vlogmas, we only have a couple days left, but you guys know I always continue to vlog after and I've got a huge trip coming up anyway. So I hope you guys are enjoying these. Don't forget to subscribe. You guys can hit the red button down below. Follow me on Instagram and TikTok because I stay up to date with you guys so much over there. I appreciate you guys watching these videos and following me and I will see you guys next time. Bye.